what do you think you got to get your game tightened up before uh tonight or what you think they're going to call you out of the audience to be to play backup for um what's his name for d booker yeah. or for uh durant oh no yeah i'm a um i'm a backup okay i'll be in here where it's warm bye So this afternoon, we are all going to drive down to uh, Salt Lake and watch the Utah Jazz play the Phoenix Suns. I think in my lifetime, I've been to two uh, NBA games, and Callie and Reed thought it would be really fun to go watch the Phoenix Suns play the Jazz, and we're going to sit on the Phoenix side. And uh, so this evening should be really fun. So today's going to be a little bit of a light duty day because we're going to leave in a few hours to drive down there. But I need to get the skid steer repaired. I broke one of the rams loose um, from where it was mounted on the plow uh, last week when I was plowing snow. So I've got to get that thing in here and get figured out uh, where the weld broke and see if I can just re-weld it. Light duty stuff today, but uh, still important stuff that has to be done. Come on, Jojo. So the other day when plowing snow, um, because we're down to the dirt now, I caught an edge or something and I put a little bit of extra pressure on this ram and I broke the ears off that hydraulic ram. So rather than pulling that ram off completely, I think I'm just going to get those, see if I can't repair this right here instead of uh, trying to take the hydraulics out of that cylinder. You can see this thing has been cracking for a while. I need to clean that up before I weld it back on. Nothing too critical. And that one's a fresh break. break and we are going to Salt Lake City to watch um, the Suns versus Jazz basketball and
We had a lot of fun last night down at the Utah Jazz Phoenix Suns basketball game. Uh, bumped into some friends. It's always fun to see friends. We got home without any issues. Uh, it was a fun night. The kids are on spring break all week. Um, and I think later in the week, we're going to take them to one of the hot springs around here just to kind of cap off uh, the spring break. But, but unfortunately, that's about as uh, much of a vacation as I want to take uh, this spring break. So, but we have the kids home for a few days and they still have chores and different things that they uh, need to do around here. And one of their chores, one of Callie and Reed's chores is firewood. I've always felt like it was important for our kids to understand uh, how we stay warm. But now we have a minor problem because we are just about out of firewood. Um, this is a good thing, though, assuming we make it out of winter without any issues. I have a whole lot of firewood over on the new property, but it's under about four feet of snow right now. But I do have enough left, I think, that'll get us through the rest of winter. But it needs to be split up, and it's a little bit chunky. And I also want to get the door cut in this week. So that's my kind of my two goals this week is to get this area cleaned up, get the new door framed in, and then go rent the saw and cut the concrete for the door. But I gotta clean this area up a little bit right here. What I'm gonna try and do is get the area cleaned up right here, and then later in the day, uh, it's supposed to be a really nice warm day, 44 degrees, which means by this afternoon, it's gonna be a muddy mess. But then Callie and Cedar and Reed are gonna come help me uh, prep the last little bit of firewood. And then hopefully, uh, pretty quick, I got a new door cut in, so.
See the crows up there riding the swells? One of the things that I love the most, and I have to remember to turn my earbuds off, is the birds. Uh, it'll get so loud with those birds doing what they got to do in the springtime um, that it's almost too much. It's almost a lot to, to, to listen to, and it, at times it can be too much. But to me, it's just an indication of, of what the, the, the world's about to do when the snow goes away, at least right here in, in our neck of the woods. So I love seeing them floating around. As long as they're not predator birds, it doesn't bother me too much. Which, by the way, we lost two chickens the other night, so. Here we go again, again. While I was at church on Sunday, I stood around and listened to the old people talk about moving to Tucson right now, or somewhere where it's not this. We just got another six inches of snow this morning. It's supposed to snow for the rest of the week. You can see the door opening over there. I managed to get the opening cut in. On our next video, I'll go into detail all about that and how, how much of a pain that was to get done. But it's supposed to snow the rest of the week. And truthfully, Tucson's looking pretty good right now.